Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I am going to test out and review the Sharp Digital Alarm Clock with Dual Alarm. Um, and this one is electric operated and then it has an optional battery backup. Um, let's take a look at the back of the box here. Here is the information on the back of the box. Uh, a lot of different information here talking about some of the different features. And here's the bottom of the box. We have the barcode right here and the model on this one is SPC100D. And then we have a warning right here. So make sure that you read through all of the information on the box and this warning. Okay, so when I opened the box, we had the instructions and warranty that were right here. And then we have these plastic pieces that we need to twist off in order to get the alarm clock out. So I'm going to do that now and then I'll be back. Okay, so here is the instructions and warranty and make sure to read through all of this information before you do use the alarm clock. And then here is the alarm clock and my first impression of it is this looks like a nice alarm clock. So um, there's also a sticker right here so make sure to peel that off. I'm going to do that now. Okay, so I've taken the sticker off and this is what the screen looks like. And before we plug this in, we need to install the battery backup, which I'm going to do now. This is the battery cover and there's a piece right here. We just need to move that in and then we can remove the battery cover. And I'm just going to set this to the side for now. And this takes two AAA batteries and you want to make sure that you install them the correct direction and it shows you the correct direction inside of the battery compartment. Okay, so I've installed the batteries and now I'm going to reinstall the battery cover and I just put this side on first and then I'm going to gently press down on this side until it snaps back into place, like so. Okay, so I just plugged the alarm clock in and here's what the screen looks like now. So let's take a closer look at everything on the top of the alarm clock. Okay, so we have the alarm on off switch right here and then we have the hour button, the minute button, the time button, the alarm button, the alarm one, two, and dual switch, and then the snooze button. Okay, so to set the time, you're going to press the time button and hold it, and then you can press the hour button to change the hour and the minute button to change the minutes, and then when you get to the time you want, you just let off the time button. And when you're changing the hour, there's also a PM light down here, so just be aware of that so you can set the correct time, whether it's AM or PM. Okay, and then to set the alarm, we have the alarm switch over here, and there's two different alarms, and then there's the option for dual alarm, but we need to pick the alarm that we want to set so we can move the switch to alarm one, so now we can set alarm one. And then to set the alarm, we're going to hold down the alarm button and then you can press the hour button to change the hours and the minute button to change the minutes. And then once you get the alarm set to where you want it to be, you just let off the alarm button. And then to set the second alarm, you would just move this switch to alarm two and then you would follow that same process of holding down the alarm button and using the hour and minute buttons to set the alarm for the time that you want it to be set for. Okay, and then to have the alarm go off, you need to move the alarm switch to the on position. And then down here, it will show you alarm one, alarm two, so it's lighting up which one is selected. So if we move this to alarm one, it goes to alarm one. And then if we move this to dual, it will show both lights here for alarm one and alarm two. And if you press the snooze button, it will turn the alarm off for nine minutes. Okay, so I've set the alarm so we can see what it sounds like. All right guys, so here's my opinion of the Sharp Digital Alarm Clock with Dual Alarm. I like the large display for the time and I like that this has two different alarms and that you can set them individually or have them both set at the same time. And I like the ascending alarm volume. I think that this is a nice alarm clock for the money. 
Thank you guys for taking the time to watch this video and I hope it's been helpful and please like, subscribe, and comment. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.